I started guest conducting here in 2005 and we were playing in the Civic Center then and then in 2007 I conducted the first opera performance in the Cobb Energy Center which was Turandot and since 2010 I've been the music director of the Atlanta Opera. I think that the quality of the productions are very high and I think it's a combination of factors that are contributing to the success of the Atlanta Opera at the moment and Tomer has done an excellent job since he's been here, artistically and both in terms of administration and, and fundraising. Carmen is one of the great operas of the standard operatic repertoire. It has so much in it. It has tremendous drama. The music is absolutely beautiful. Everybody knows the Toreador song. I mean, every hit opera also has some hit tunes in it. But that's not the most important factor in making an opera great. You know, it's interesting, Bizet's uh, maternal grandparents were Spanish. So in terms of the whole orchestral writing, you feel sort of a mixture of a French and Spanish style in the music and in the orchestration. It's a very unique combination of the two. As an opera conductor, you also have to identify with the emotions of any particular character in any particular scene. <laughs> so, you know, it, it kind of what happens at the end of the opera with the, with the killing of Carmen, it kind of tears your heart out, really. There's some very tricky ensemble work in Carmen, the Carmen Quintet, some of the choruses. It's a big challenge. So as you do an opera, more and more, certain things become more comfortable. But the challenge is to be there and identify with everything that's happening at the same time and to be able to control the forces, be able to unify the orchestra, get the right color in the orchestra, unify the orchestra with the stage, with the singers, with the chorus, and so forth. I mean, it's always a big challenge. I think the appeal of Carmen, number one, is this incredible libretto, this incredible story, coupled with very powerful dramatic music and a very strong folkloristic element. I mean, you really have a sense of people out in a piazza, in, you know, in 95 degree weather. And the conflict also, not only between uh, José and Carmen, but the conflict in the fighting chorus of the women. I mean, there's always something, uh, there's so many elements. Then there's the element of his pure love for Micaela and his, you know, absolutely violent, sensual passion for Carmen. You've got so many elements that, that come together in this drama and it's all reflected in the music.